Hello everybody, it's Vegetarian here, and welcome back to Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl. In the last episode, we caught the legendary Pokemon Cresselia, and in this episode, we are going to catch three more legendaries, the Regis. Minus Regigigas, we're saving him for next episode. So here we are, Raminus Park, Romanus Park, the park. Alright, we're at the park. And over here, I believe we talked to you. No, you sell Pokeballs. I want to talk to you. You can exchange mysterious shards for slates. As you can see, I have 10 small shards and 3 large shards. So we're just gonna buy 3 of these. And now we can get 3 legendaries. Now I don't know if this is fact or not, but I believe you have to start with the Regis. You can't start with any other legendary. Let's talk to you. You might be one of the powerful people attracted by the Raminous Roses. So these nice roses over here apparently attract powerful people. But as you can see, we have all these different caves that we can go in. The Johto Room. But I don't think we can activate them yet. I think we do have to do the Regis first. So we'll check them out another time. Because we are going to be catching legendary Pokemon. I don't know if I'm going to catch them, like, on the channel. Because the Johto ones really aren't that interesting. It's only the Regis and I think a secret super boss. But here we are in the Discovery Room. This is the Regi Room. So let's walk forward. There's an enigmatic pedestal. You may be able to use a slate on it. Would you like to use a discovery slate? Yes, sir. <laughs> it's like, this looks like some Zelda stuff. The discovery slate fit in perfectly. I don't know why I slurred my S on slate. The pedestal started to shine. And here we are in pure space. I don't know if this is a cave or not, I'm gonna save, because in front of us, we have Regice. Or Regice, whatever you prefer calling him. Yo, that theme hit way too hard. We're opening with my guy Surge, just in case the quick ball doesn't work, so we can paralyze it. Oh my gosh, alright, he's also level, level 70. Just like Heatran, that's great. Toss Quick Ball. Only one shake. Alright. Alright, I'm gonna hit him with this Thunder Wave to paralyze. I guess I can risk a low sweep. I have also Gallade with False Swipe, just in case. This guy's firing off Blizzard. So don't bring your Obama Snow to fight Regice, because it'll just give him a 100% accurate Blizzard. Okay, he could tank it. That's good. And he's firing off a Zap Cannon, but Levi has a great special defense. But he got paralyzed. But you're paralyzed too. I'm just gonna go for the False Swipe. How many is this gonna take? A few, okay. Alright, he's at low enough health. I don't know if Dusk Balls are gonna work or not. Cause we're technically in a cave, unless the slate teleported us. I'm gonna try it? And see how far we get with one. Let's see. One. Alright. Okay, so I just looked it up, and Dusk Balls do not work in Raminus Park unless you're playing at nighttime. So, good thing I've been chucking Ultra Balls. Dang it, come on, that was three! I was just looking at him very intensely, hoping that he would just stay in the ball. Okay, we might have to leave and get more Ultra Balls after this one, because I thought I could use my Dusk Balls, so I brought a bunch of Dusk Balls and not that many Ultra Balls. Like, over 50 seems like a lot, but when you're catching three Legendaries, not that much. Yes! We caught him! That was actually pretty quick. I've only been recording for nine minutes so far. Regice, the iceberg Pokemon. Its body is made of ice from the Ice Age. It controls frigid air of negative 328 degrees Fahrenheit. Damn. And then we just get transported back. Whoa, this is cool. And then there's a little replica of Regice there. What an amazing Pokemon you've caught. I'll give you a statue that looks just like it. Oh, wow. We get the statues for legendaries after we catch them? That is amazing. Is, is it a shiny statue, though? This is a rare statue only available in Raminus Park. 
police put it up in your secret base in the Grand Underground. So now we are back. And yes, we'd like to put in another Discovery Slate. I'm assuming it's going to pick Reggie Steel next, because that's the next one in the lineup. It's Reggie Rock, never mind. Let me save right before this battle. And let us encounter him. So, uh, dang, I didn't read the dialogue. Hello, Reggie Rock. Would you be so kind to stay in this quick ball I'm going to throw you? It's a lovely color scheme. And honestly, it's really comfy in there. There's a couch. He didn't care about the couch. Ooh, you're dumb. I got motor drive. Let me go for some ice punches. Let me see if I can get an ice punch freeze. Wow, I forgot you have a lot of physical defense. Stop going for zap cannon. Oh, he finally goes for a stone edge. Okay, that could be really bad. So I'm just going to go for the thunder wave because that's my only status move that I have on all of my Pokemon that I have with me. So we're going to paralyze him just in case we go down. And he's going to go for a super power. And that's going to take Surge down. First Ultra Ball. Let's see if we got him. First try. Three. Yes. Oh, that was even quicker. Man, these Regis are easy. And Levi grows to level 66. Reggie Rock, the Rock Peak Pokemon. Its entire body is made of rock. If any part chips off in battle, Reggie Rock attaches rocks to repair itself. All right, it is time for Reggie Steel. Yep, insert the plate Zelda style. And now we can get transport to pure space one more time for Reggie Steel. And here we go, the last of the main Reggie Trio. And then we have the creator, Reggie Gigas. We're not counting Reggie Lucky or Reggie Drago because, you know, they're in Galar. And this isn't Galar. First turn, Quick Ball. Let's see our luck. Two. All right. You know, I've been playing these games a lot recently. Like, since the games came out, I've completed four full playthroughs from start to Cynthia. And I'm in the middle of doing three more right now. How much is a low sweep going to do to you? Just, just curious. Okay, doesn't do that much. I'm gonna go for an Ice Punch just to do a teeny tiny bit more because I don't want to knock him out. Alright, he tanks it. Alright, you are 1 HP. You are paralyzed. It is time to throw the Pokeballs. So, how are all your days going? That's what I want to know. Put it down in the comments below. How's your day going? What are you doing? You should also like and subscribe while you're down there because, you know, if you're watching this far, you clearly like my content. Oh, three! Oh, we got him! After my shameless plug. <laughs> we caught him! That Re See? Reggie Steel liked that. Penguin grew to level 67 and Yukina grew to level 66. The Iron Pokemon. Tempered by the pressure underground over tens of thousands of years, its body cannot be scratched. And there we go! We caught all the Reggies! Do we get like a special cutscene or something? We do! I was kidding. I did not expect us to get a special cutscene. Huh. If we look at the statues, we can't talk to them, but we can look at them. That's awesome. What amazing Pokemon. Yeah, yeah. Give me the statues. Reggie Rock and Reggie Steel. Thank you. And you know what? We got enough time. Let's just do all of them. I really expected to sit here for an hour to try and catch the Reggies. And it only took like 20 minutes. Let me not jinx it though. You know, Reggie Gigas might just keep us here for maybe a few hours. You never know. So, north of Snow Point, there is the Snow Point Temple. Only the Chosen may enter the Snow Point Temple. I'm sorry, but you'll have to leave? Uh, I am the- Oh! Okay, thank you, Candace. She probably saw this happening, and she said, How can this be? <laughs> I'm so funny. It's okay. You can let that person in. Cynthia sent word to me. You're working on a Pokedex, aren't you? There should be many rare Pokemon in the temple. Enjoy your exploring. Yeah, take that lady. Can't keep the champion out. An issue that I do have with these games is the movement. Like, 
if I move one space on the D-pad, my character will move more than one space, and it's incredibly annoying. Yep, yep. So now we just go to the right and go up, and boom, we solved it. Big brain energy. Okay, we need to do something with this strength boulder. But I don't know what. Okay, so we just push it there. I thought we had to push it on the single block of ice. I don't know why. And we gotta never melt ice. This is where you get it. It boosts the power of ice type moves. So it's like the icicle play, except it doesn't change Arceus's type. <laughs> oh my gosh, he's just standing there. Okay, there we go. We're making progress. Now we gotta go down. Yes. Okay. And there we go. We made it to him. It's a statue of a Pokemon. It seems to exude power. This is a statue? I mean, I guess that explains why he's just stationary. You read the engraved writing. A body of rock, a body of ice, a body of steel. When gather the three Pokemon, the king shall appear. Well, it looks like I do need to bring them. No, I'm not going to change the layout, but just know that they're in the party and we're rocking with Serge, Yukina, and Levi. So now let's save, and if we talk to him... Oh, here we go. Zit zit! Here we go. The founding titan, I guess you could call him, because, you know, the Reggies are titans. Reggie Gigas. And of course, he has slow start. One of the worst abilities in the game. Let's throw a first quick ball. And he breaks out immediately. He's showing that he's not a pushover. And he, you see, he's level 70. In platinum, he was level 1. <laughs> Reggie Gigas got his act together, which means five turns have passed. Let me switch into Levi, so I just hit a false swipe and then start chucking balls. Since we are inside of a temple, which I guess could be counted as a cave, we're gonna throw a Dusk Ball and have him break out immediately. Throwing more Dusk Balls. Come on, man. Hey, man, speaking of Titans, Attack on Titan Season 4 Part 2 just dropped, and we're getting them every- Oh my gosh! And we're getting them every Sunday, just like the Demon Slayer Season 2 episodes. We're going to be eating good on Sundays. Except Levi, because he just passed out. Um, Yukina? I mainly brought her here to tank out normal type moves, but he has heavy slam. So I'm going to double team. Just set up six double teams and also throw out some timer balls because I have those too. That's double team number three, and he has not hit me yet. Final double team, and now we can start throwing timer balls, because more than 10 turns have passed. Wait, he hit a heavy- He hits a heavy slam? I just set up six double teams. Alright, Registeel can tank a lot of moves, except Hammer Arm. So, he has to oppose his father. Come on. Registeel, convince your father to join the good side! We're the good side! I mean, he's just gonna be sitting in a PC box- Oh, critical capture! No! I was getting ready to say yes, but no! A second critical capture in a row? And he still doesn't want to get caught? How high are your standards? He's going for the heavy slam. On Reggie Steel. All right, all right. I'm gonna go back to throwing Dusk Balls, cause this just isn't working. These Timer Balls, not it. Yep, here comes the Hammer Arm. Reggie Steel tanks it, but not that well. Another Hammer Arm. Oh my gosh, did that was that a crit? It was. I could heal Reggie Steel. That rhymed. But I'm just gonna throw the Timer Ball. Three! Yes! It was the right call! And Surge grows to level 67. Why does he look really funny when he's just standing up straight? 
The Colossal Pokemon, much like the Colossal Titan. There is an enduring legend that states this Pokemon towed continents with ropes. And that's it, you don't get any sort of reward. <laughs> you gonna say anything to me? The temple- Really? You... I, I caught Reggie Gigas, guys. Nobody's gonna say anything? So the Reggies are sitting pretty in the legendary box. So that'll be all for this episode. So if you enjoyed, make sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell to get notified whenever I upload. See ya, that's all. Bye, guys.